He's been perfect so far this season. As long as a 44 yarder. Hold is down, and the kick is good. The best is good. Back deep. Taymon Cook will return this one from around the five. He's got a hole down the sideline. Cook, can he beat the kicker? He can, and he's in for six. For the second time this season. Cook using that speed, getting to the sideline. And winning the foot race all the way to the end zone. Owen Daffer will come on for the extra point. Hold is down, kick. a t bringing pressure. Watkins flings it down the sideline. He's got Sanchez. Green grass in front of him and in for six. Thirty-nine yard field goal. Mercurio's kick is good. Villanova showing pressure. The Cats bring it. White stepping up. Changes direction. He's got plenty of room. 10, 5, and into the end zone. Touchdown, North Carolina AT. The freshman, KJ White, scores his third touchdown of the season. Field. And it's a foot race all the way to the end zone. Great run by K.J. White. Barley. Able to trot down the sideline. He reaches for the pylon and scores. Touchdown, Wildcats. Phenomenal run by Barley. Breaking one tackle at one level. Keeping his feet moving. Running aggressively, getting through the point of contact over the pylon for Villanova touchdown. Now the Wildcats will work quickly. Watkins rolling out, looking towards the end zone, complete to Pringle. Did he hold on? Watkins on the snap, rolling out, throwing the ball, hitting Pringle in the corner of the end zone. 19 yard field goal attempt. And Mercurio, no questions asked on that one. 17 unanswered points in the final four, 56 of the first half. Watkins going hard count. Finds Sanchez at the 30, and he's headed for Painter. Touchdown, Wildcats. Who is Connor Watkins' favorite target. Sanchez just runs up the field. Racing to the end zone for his second trip to pay dirt. Jackson fumbles. a t says they have it, and so do the officials. So much for the no turnovers by Villanova. Vincent Brown making his way to go shake hands with Mark Ferrante. Two guys that have gone up against each other for a while. And that will do it here in Greensboro. The final score, 37-14.